Welcome to Chef Alley's Farm Fresh Kitchen. Join us as we meet from the land of Kansas members and explore new recipes using local Kansas ingredients and products. We Welcome back everybody. We're here with Chef Allie's Farm Fresh Kitchen in our From the Land of Kansas segment. Yeah. Allie, we've got a special guest. You brought lots of props today. So yes, I did. And I'd it. like to introduce Daniel Rockholst from mm -hmm. Great Plains Manufacturing, Inc. Good morning. And morning. talk to us a little bit about your company. I know you're based in Kansas and have um, seven or eight manufacturing plants mm -hmm. across the state of Kansas. But I know you're international as well. So right. talk to us a little bit about that and why, how you bring Kansas to the world. Okay, well, um, yeah, um, I'm the head of the Great Plains International Division uh -huh. of Great, and we have uh, over 150 people working for us in uh, several countries we have, with subsidiaries, and uh, we basically um, uh, export to them either through distributors or through our own subsidiaries overseas. What do you export? We export uh, agricultural implements. Okay. So, uh, for example, I brought some samples here. Uh, this would be uh, uh, grain drills. This would be a 26-foot machine in real real life, or this would be a 13-foot machine. Wow! But we're the largest family-owned uh, manufacturer of agricultural implements in North America. Oh wow! With 1,600 employees. Wow. Well, you brought with you also some of the things that that talk about your innovation and your great technology that you right. bring with Great Plains. So, talk to us just a little bit about that. Yeah. Well, we um, use state-of-the-art equipment to uh, manufacture. Uh -huh. And for example, uh, we uh, we uh, have a laser print, a laser printer, sorry, a 3D printer. Uh -huh. Right. Uh, we uh, produce uh, parts with to uh, to prototype for manufacturing. Uh, okay. So that, for example, this this piece here was printed with a 3D laser printer. Uh, this piece was printed with a 3D laser printer. <laughs> Pretty amazing. And, and so we're in the past. We had a lot of uh, we took a lot of time to test pr machines. We uh -huh. to build the prototypes. We'd have to send the parts, in, the design parts in to companies to make for us and then mm -hmm. it would take a while for them to make them and send them back to us. Right. Now we can make the pieces in-house and we can test them. Much quicker. Uh, much quicker and then come up with a solution. This here, for example, is a piece we came up with. Uh, this is also, this was done with our 3D printer mm -hmm. and uh, there's two pieces to it. It's, it becomes a casting. And so now Very we good. can we can uh, send this to the company, the cast company, and they can make a cast for it much quicker than they could in the past. So we have a m much faster turnaround time to build new models and, and new machines or new components. Right. And so um, I think part of the neat thing about, too, that we've been discussing as you were here this morning, the Kansas workers that you yeah. have in your facilities, um, how, what a great work ethic they have. And I know that you wanted to talk about that just a little bit, too. Yeah, yeah how are you excited to be affiliated with Kansas? You know? Well, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm originally from Germany, and, and the one thing that I noticed when I came to work for Great Plains or came to Kansas was the culture in Kansas. The culture in Kansas is... Uh, Basically, uh, Kansas is usually a, a politically central uh, in the center, mm -hmm. and Kansas don't want to rock the boat, and they want to make sure they, uh, the, they uh, satisfy and delight their neighbors, delight right. uh, the people yeah. around them. And this is kind of the culture of Great Plains manufacturing right. as well. And, and so, great work uh, ethic. That has a great work <laughs> ethic, and, and uh, we have plants in uh, eight Kansas towns, oh, wow. especially, especially small towns, and uh -huh. they're wonderful work, workers. And I and think so, I saw on your website you have over a thousand uh, Kansas employees that work right, for your company. Correct. And so, so we 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 like to be affiliated with from the land of Kansas because of the um, because of that because of the uh, the origin from Kansas that we we export to the world, but we're also. Mm -hmm. Uh, satisfying other people's needs, what they want, we, we're finding out what, they, what they'd like us to make for them or do for them, and then we, we aim to and please. And you do it, yes. So. And I, you, you touched on one word that I noticed on your website, that you really like to delight your customers <laughs> yep. and customize um, the implements that you build for them. Um, and so we were, we're thrilled to have you as Thank a guest yes, um, on Chef Ellie's Farm uh -huh. Fresh Kitchen. And in honor of Great Plains, I came up with a Great Grains mm -hmm. salad. This is a barley berry salad that we're going to toss that together. Delicious. Yes, yep. it's got an agave nectar dressing. Mm -hmm. We've got chickpeas and cranberries, golden raisins Yum. and apples. So it's going to be a treat for everybody from the land of Kansas to yeah. enjoy. Thank you soon. so much. Thank, yeah. you Thank you for telling much. us about what you do. Yeah. All right, we'll be right back. Thanks. Make sure to tune in the second and fourth Thursday of every month to meet more From the Land of Kansas members. Remember, visit FromTheLandOfKansas.com to explore and find Kansas foods, products, and services.